Hey YouTube, it's Asun SG over here and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna do a video about FIFA 22 new features. Uh, for this video I'm gonna show you new gameplay, new tactics uh, that is gonna be on FIFA 22 and also the new foot champion format. Hit the subscribe button if you wanna have good luck on the next pack opening. So hey guys, for the first feature on FIFA 22, we have got the gameplay and tactics. Uh, on the gameplay, we have got the player switching. Uh, when defending, pressing the R3 lets you choose between three of the closest players that you have got. So yeah, uh, this is a new thing on FIFA 22. So you can choose three of the closest players that you want on with the R3 by pressing it. And it also says that they all have an arrow uh, set for the direction you flick the R3. Uh, and also it says that it can still also use R1 or flick the right stick as normal. So hey guys, this is a new thing on uh, FIFA 22. Uh, so let's go for the second thing. We have got the second man press. And it says that it has got nerfed a bit. So it means it has gotten weaker. Uh, so it says over here there is a little green arrow above the player that is second man pressing and it depletes quickly 3 or 4 seconds max So yeah guys, uh, the second man press has gotten much more weaker on FIFA 22 and it is harder to use it So it says also as soon as it depletes the player's press isn't as intense and basically non-existent also pulls your player out of the position so yeah guys a second man press is not good to use it on fifa 22 because you can get your player out of position so yeah guys let's go to the custom tactics over here it says on fifa 22 that you can customize your offensive tactic but not the defensive tactic so on the offensive tactic we have got the build up play uh, which it says uh, you can make it balanced, slow build up, fast build up and long ball. So over here it has been added the slow build up. And for the chance creation we have got a new tactic on the FIFA 22. And it also has got over there uh, balanced, possession, forward runs and direct passing. So these two last things have been added on FIFA 22 the forward rounds and direct passing so let's see what they are gonna be so yeah no change on defensive tactic so hey guys this was it for the gameplay and the tactics on FIFA 22 let's see if there is gonna be much more uh, later on on the FIFA 22 so now let's go to the second future on the second future we have got the FIFA 22 heat maps and expected goals so a, in a series of other leagues it looks as if heat maps will be introduced in FIFA 22 it says over here and also it says that uh, it gives the players another layer of stats analyzing to look at, at for each player on the pitch so not only that but the infamous expected goals will be added to players and the team stat so yeah you can see a picture over here and also there is a new cool thing on the cut skins we have got the pre-match jumpers instead of wearing just the basic shirts and shorts attire before matches you have got uh, the team jumpers as you can see over here I handle Di Maria and Dortmund players over there so yeah it looks very cool on FIFA 22 so yeah this was it for the second future on FIFA 22 now let's go to the third Hey okay, guys, for the third future on FIFA 22, we have got a new full champion format. Over here, it says that uh, we have got to play less than 30 games on the new FIFA 22. So, weekend league uh, qualifications are required every week, and we have got five games to play and need to win three or more uh, for qualification and we can only enter three times in a week so we have got three lifelines to get qualified for the next food champion weekend league and also for the fifa 22 food champions reward uh, it says that there will be certain players in rewards and now the higher the rank you are the better version of the players you are gonna get 
So this turns out to be accurate. There may never be a more important time to climb the ranks in foot champions than in FIFA 22. So we have to wait and see how it shapes up. So hey guys, this was it for the third feature on FIFA 22 for the foot champion new format and also for the new rewards. The fourth uh, feature on FIFA 22, we have got the new icons added to FIFA 22. We have got the Gabriel Bastituta over there, Iker Casillas, Chab Bunkum, Diago Forlan, Lucio, Park Jisong, Wesley Schneider, uh, Jeff Stam, Robin Van Persie. Comment down below which one are you eager to see on FIFA 21, which one you want to have on your team. And also smash that subscribe button if you want to get on FIFA 22 in one of them. So yeah. Uh, so yeah guys, this is the FIFA 22 new icons leaks. So there are gonna be very very good things on FIFA 22. Like playing on PlayStation 5 of course. Also for the fifth future on FIFA 22 we have got the formation. 4 3 2 1 uh, which, uh, which is gonna be apparently be more different now on FIFA 22 because the left forward and the right forward will be converted to center forward so hey guys uh, these two players over here on the left and the right are gonna be changed to CF so center forwards and also I think the striker is gonna be a center forward as well so the Formation 4321 won't be the same as the previous FIFAs. So, hey guys, this was it for today's video. If you have enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below what should I do next. If you haven't subscribed yet, click the subscribe button over here if you want to see more of my FIFA videos. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.